In this lesson, we will learn how to iterate over rows and columns in pandas. So to iterate over rows and columns, we will see some functions, some built-in functions provided by pandas. First we will iterate over rows and then we will iterate over columns. Let's begin with iteration over rows. Okay, to iterate over rows, we will use the following two methods iter rows and and the second one iter tuples okay we will see two examples one for iter rows and uh, the second for iter tuples let's see here is a pycharm id we are using the free and open source pycharm community edition go to file create a new project for uh, this lesson name it I'll name it let's say pandas iteration because we are learning iteration here you can mention any name and the project will get saved here click create we have created it pandas iteration now let me add two files right click new python file name the file let me name it demo1 when i'll press enter it will automatically add the .py extension why because python file is by default selected press enter now create a new file again right click new python file demo2 and we have created two files demo1 demo2 Now we will learn how to iterate over rows. Let me add the comments first. Pandas iter rows method to iterate over rows. Let me import pandas first. I'll also add an alias. Import pandas as pd. pd is an alias. Now I'll add the data. Okay, data set for our data frame. I have created a data object. The first column. I'm adding records of five students started with id comma student this will add the name i'm adding the name of five students next let me add a rank also the final column for our example now create a new object and we will create a data frame I'll be adding pandas that is pd pandas dot data frame data now print the data frame you can mention here student records now we will iterate over rows I'll mention for row in data frame dot iter rows so we have used the iter rows method now mention print here and print the row colon we miss the colon file save all right click run demo so it will display the rows one by one 
okay here it is here is our data frame and here are the rows it displayed it one by one okay I should add display the rows we have displayed the rows one by one okay this looks fine now I have added a new line so this is a particular row so we saw how to iterate over rows using the iter rows method in the next example we will iterate over rows using the iter tuples method as the name suggests each row is returned as a python tuple object so let us see the example here is our uh, pandas iter tuples method import pandas okay now consider the data let's say i'll take the following same data okay three columns and we added the data to a data frame using the data frame method and we displayed the data frame here now I trade over rows using the iter tuples for row in data frame our data frame name was the following dot iter tuples that's it colon and print the row that's it here you can also mention a message let's say display records as a tuple object file file save all right click run demo to here you can see our data frame with three columns and five records and here is a tuple object we have iterated now all the records are visible as a tuple object we saw how to iterate over rows using iter tuples it returned a python tuple object for all the records now we will see how to iterate over columns using the items method this method will allow you to iterate over each and every column and the result will be displayed as a label object that will include the name of the column and a column object that will include the column values let's see the example We will see how to iterate over columns using the items method this will display a label object that will include the column name and the and a column object with the column values import pandas create a data set let me take it from here paste we have our data with three columns and we have records for five students okay we have created a data frame now I iterate over columns use the for loop for a comma b 
so data frame dot items will allow you to iterate over columns that's it colon and print a one by one print b go to file save all right click run demo 3 now let's see what is the output first it displayed the entire data frame why because we printed student records the data frame then one by one we have printed the columns that included first the column name then the column value okay it's written here column name this was for the first column then came the second column and then the last column so one by one it iterated it okay we can also mention this here I trade over each column okay this is fine okay so we have mentioned it here I trading the columns one by one so we saw how to iterate over columns using the items method in this lesson we saw how to iterate over rows and columns in pandas